If I have to fight Jasper and it doesn't automatically go into the final boss fight, I'll probably make that transition if there's no other save point before here. Uh, a campfire would be most ideal. But I don't think I'm going to get that lucky. Oh, of course you have friends. Oh, he's dead. Ooh, nice. Got a chapter. Can you not pick on him, please? Yeah, that card. Oh. Oh, a little bit of deja vu right there. I feel like I've been in this situation at least once. Pretty weak. Hendrick. Yeah. Oh, I think he actually deflected one. You know, the temptation is there just to go back and get my HP back, but mostly just a joke because I just have to fight these guys all over again. Final boss should be pretty hype. Yeah. I'm expecting at least two phases. Probably uh, a Mordrigan phase and and then a uh, like a Lord of Shadows phase. This game still, still has not explained why Mordrigan is the Lord of Shadows and why everybody's referring to him as Lord of Shadows. And if it has, like, I must have glossed over it 10 hours ago, 15 hours ago. Just leave us alone. You can just leave us alone. Okay, no treasure chest behind. I'm just coming through, dog. Don't mind me. There's a chest. It's a poker. It's a spear. Attacks cannot be blocked or parried. Oh, that's pretty good. Actually, has some really nice damage on it, too. I guess that uh, magical menu. Listen, you cannot wear it because it's for girls. When has that ever stopped anybody? Hmm. 
Sometimes I sit at these black loading screens and I think to myself, these are the transitions I need to use to cut up this whole playthrough. And so I shouldn't say anything. Then I think to myself, I don't say anything. We're just staring at a black screen. It's one of those double-edged swords. Okay, well, I'll just, you know, just have everyone else enjoy the greatness that is the black screen. There's so many other pretty things to look at. Black screen is pretty too. Alright. Um. Kind of close to levels for a couple people, but I'm not gonna fight these guys. Even though if I fought both of those great dragons, I'd get a level on main character. Hmm, that's not how I thought that would play out. I'm not rewarded with the treasure chest behind one of those things. Yeah, yeah, you can just chill. I don't know why anybody would want to fight you when they could just go around you. Stardust sword. This is a one-handed sword. Oh, here's the sword of light. This is also just a one-handed sword. Deals lightning damage. Cures a single ally of negative status effects when used as an item in battle. That's pretty good. Sword is pretty blah, though. Yeah, this is just a regular sword, too. It's a nice 8% proc, though. Also, they didn't give me a two-handed sort of light. That, that kind of bugs me. You know, it's like, should I really have gone one-hander and shield for the game? Like, is that the... Uh, the playstyle that is most effective? I didn't even see any dual-wielding abilities on the main character. If he was dual-wielding, that would be dope. Alright, tempted to just go back down and save right now, but... Okay... Oh, I don't think I'll be going around these guys. The tail's in the way. Yeah, just... Oh! Like, just move the tail out of the way, this will be perfect. <laughs> All right, it's fine. I could use the experience off these guys. Ow. But you know what I should have done? I should have just went around the side and I could have just jumped onto the platform. That would have been perfect. Well, as long as he doesn't attack main character. Yeah. What's most likely to deal the most damage to you? Eh, yeah, let's just more heal. Oh my goodness. For the kill? Hey. So what's the other side for, then? Part of the Fortress of Fear is now open. 
Maybe the other side is to... Unlock the red door? Maybe? Oh, this one's gonna be tricky. Alright, just gotta perfectly... Alright, your sword is in the way, dog. No! Your sword has a hitbox. The loss leaders something... Okay. Okay. You guys aren't playing games. And they don't take very much damage. Uh, let's see what a quadra slash does against them. Okay. More heal. Can you not kill her, please? Holy moly. Nice crit. I might keep you in the game. With another quadra. Oh, okay, I was like, that one didn't die. In trouble. To heal. I'm not done yet. How did I use that ability? All is well that ends well. Nope. Aha, so this is for the red door. I have no idea what's on the other side of the red door, and I'm gonna go find out. Go blocking the doll of the hall. Get that. Under chest? Nothing. Alright, so once again, we're gonna go all the way back down. Not too crazy, is it? No. All the way back down. Geronimo! Alright. Oh, this better be freaking godlike, man. Meteorite Bracer. Found godlike. We swear that we'll see the wearer speeding about in place faster than a shooting star. Whoa! That's a hundred agility! Now that is good. Okay, who are we giving that to? We giving that to you, my man. Heck yeah. Okay, and then uh, you got. Why? Why are you using this? Oh, three MP restored. Uh, this is not too useful. So we're gonna give you the agility ring. Oh ho ho! A hundred agility on an accessory? That's so good! So good! I'm gonna go back and save now. Oh, these, uh, these respawn? No. Alright, you know what? Because you can't competently use your crossbow, you have to deal with problems like these.
Really? Can I just cheat? You know, I've tried to run from maybe like five fights in this entire game. And I think I've only successfully ran from one. Okay, my dog. Uh, and it, it's a little frustrating that running from fights is just... It, I mean, it, it could be a 50-50, it could be a percentage based off of, you know, like a various number of stat factors or whatever. I'm a person of the opinion that if you're going to run from a fight, or if you're going to put the option to run from a fight, it should just be a guaranteed run. I mean, sure, you know, you you could get into situations where you're going to bypass certain encounters that you may not want to, but if you don't want those encounters to be bypassed, don't let them be ran from. Gray out the, the run part. Seems uh, pretty easy to me. All right, keep your cloak away from me, man. Okay, so... Gonna grab a... Grab these. That should be the green one. Please only one, no robots. Dang it. Just dang it on all accounts. Did we notice that uh, Homeboy Slice went first? Pretty great. Uh, Hendrick being Homeboy Slice. Uh, truthfully, I should probably put it on Rab. But I actually don't know if having high agility means you get like more turns. Or if it just means you get to act sooner. Because if it just means you get to act sooner, it's really... ...not that great on Hendrik. Whereas on Rab, I can utilize a sap, like, very early on and take advantage of it. My strength grows ever greater! I think I might be able to utilize these points. The luminary. Is this worth? I don't I don't know if it's worth. But I am getting close to the final battle, so maybe maybe it's something that I need to actually consider getting. Um, this is more important though. 5% pep, but yeah, let's go ahead and grab it. Power Yig Yig Dragon's Blessing. Yig Dragon. Yeah. Getting all these points from. What were you saying for? What are we saving? Oh, probably that. Uh, Hendrick. I think we're out of things to care about for Hendrick. Hmm. Yeah, we're out of things to care about for Hendrix, so I guess we'll just grab this. 
Old front. That's good. He needed something. All right, here we go. Slowly we rise to the top. Uh, and we do have to fight Jasper first. Uh, our f Actually, I don't know if we fought Jasper yet. Yeah, I don't think we did. Final floor, let's see, now we want to go up this way. Which is probably, well, at least not like super demon Jasper. We did fight Jasper. All right, here we go. Palace of Malice. And a Mimic. Or it's going to be MP items. A surprise. Always MP items for some reason. Right before, uh, like, a big fight. Alright, there's gonna be enemies dropping from the ceiling. I could just... Did anyone else see that? Am I trip? I must be tripping. very very boss upcoming it does long hallway uh, uh, the MP right beforehand absolutely Veronica. Now you're here. Can I ask you something? Can I ask you to die? I told you. I was actually gonna say, like, she's gonna, like, ask us, can I kill you or something like that. You'll do that for me, won't you? I mean, I had to die and you didn't. That can't be fair, can it? So come on. What do you say? Will you die for me or not? I wanted to live, but because of you, I couldn't. So let's even things up. Come on, drop dead. <gasps> no! <laughs> Flee! Foul phantom, dark intrusion, light dispel this black illusion. Veronica would never have said such awful things. Go on, be off with you. <laughs> she didn't regret a thing. I know she didn't. She died with hope in her heart. Hope that we would bring back the light. Uh, hmm. This is your doing. I sense it. Jasper, show yourself! <laughs> Still, you speak of hope? Of light? Even now, with one of your little band beyond saving, your faith is sickening. <laughs> My 
dear Hendrik, still you cling stubbornly to life. You never did know when to give up. Yet another virtue to despise in you. You come here seeking an audience with my master, I suppose. Well, I'm afraid I shall have to disappoint you. I would ask you to leave politely. But we both know you are too pig-headed to listen. And besides, I would not want your journey to have been in vain. surpassed me in wickedness and naught else. Bold words indeed, but you will pay for them with your life. I shall offer up your broken bodies in tribute to almighty Mordigan. Gasper Unbound. This is gonna be a difficult fight. I can feel it. We're about to lose our pep. That was that dang dog. Alright, well you're gonna have to multi-heal. Ow. Okay, just do more of those. Alright, so you got cold front. Not what I want. Um, let's go with another kabuff. Okay, I could go on the offensive here. But my line of thinking here is I'd like to either sap him or blunt him. Sap first. We'll go gr on the greed side. All right, get a little bit of greed. Okay, get punished for the greed. Girls on my buffs. Let's just recast them. Goodbye. You can call for backup? <sighs> These are not the problems I need right now. Trying to debate whether I want to res Axarot or heal Hendrick. 
And even now, I'm still not sure which was the proper choice. I'm going to take a huge chance here. Huge chance. <laughs> really? Okay. Haven't gotten punished. Let's use an Omni Hill. Um, keep buffing up. If a blunt will be nice. Of nonsense is just not cool. This is some very serious. This is some serious damages. Yes, not as bad as Tatsunaga, but pretty bad. Go with the Quadra. Do a multi heal. Okay. Need to refresh our Kabuff. He's in the yellow, though. We're getting there. Uh, the blunt actually really helped a lot alongside with the, uh, the kabuff. We're hanging in there. We might just die right now. Oof. Oof, oof, oof. In the orange. That's more heal. Uh-oh. Done. Yes. All is well that ends well. Forty two thousand. Not bad. Alright, Jade got her level up. Wanna give her her AoE ability. Hopefully she can use it. First among demons, supreme commander of the Spectral Sentinels, how could mere humans defeat me? Ah. 
Again, you surpass me. Again, you outdo me. Again, you... You leave me behind! Hmm. The more you bathed in glory, the more brightly you shone, the more I receded into shadow. Do you know what it was that I always wanted? I wanted to be like you. Hendrick's like, well, now that that's over with, let's move on to more important matters. The Silva Orb. All right, awarded for having at least 100,000 gold coins on one person at once. Yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, everybody's at full. So... I'm going to go forward, and I'm hoping the game doesn't make me regret this, because what I want to do right now is I want to go all the way back and save, but I'm not going to do that. I'm hoping that they're going to give me a save point up here, and I hope they're not going to put me into a boss battle right away. This is the hope. the time has come to face him. Oh, slow your roll, people. Hey, no fair. Let me go. Can't move. <laughs> Did you think me beaten? Did you think you had bested me? I, Jasper, Supreme Commander of the Spectral Sentinels. Huh? Didn't we beat all of these guys? How can they be back? <laughs> oh, Hendrik, your face. Now you'll see who has left who behind. By all means, go to face my master, Luminary. But know that you will do so alone. Your friends here will be staying with us. <laughs> He shall not go alone. I swore an oath. I am the Luminary's sword, his shield, his unswerving companion. We all are. We're in this together. If we face Mordigan, we face him as one. Aye. If you think I'm missing my chance to get revenge for my Eleanor after all these years, you've another thing coming. Don't worry, darling. I'm with you all the way. We're going to bring smiles and sunshine back to the world if it's the last thing we do. Yes, I promised Veronica I would finish this. And that's a promise I mean to keep. You heard. We're in this together. I'm not leaving anyone to suffer alone ever again. But what you don't know, Eric, is we're actually leaving you behind. I'm supposed to help the Luminary. And that means to the bitter end.
It is over, Jasper. Be still. <laughs> no, I cannot die yet. I have yet to surpass you. You speak of surpassing me, but in truth, it is I who always followed in your wake. <clears throat> you were the one who spurred me on, the light that guided me. Without you, I would never have become myself. How is it that you never knew? <laughs> Hendrik. It is time. Mordigan must pay. I'm gonna go back to save. <laughs> Bear with me on this one. Oh my goodness. Uh, interesting that all those guys came back. Also interesting that my entire party went Super Saiyan. And basically killed them all with one Super Saiyan ability. Why couldn't we just do that before? The power of friendship. We had it all along. Alright, so go ahead and uh, take your guesses on how many phases Mortigan's gonna have. I'm guessing two. But I wouldn't be surprised if it's three. Best ending, leave Eric behind. Yeah, Eric. I'm sorry, man. Would've been better if you guys just tossed Eric to fight him all solo while you left for the final boss. Uh, he kind of did that in the beginning of the game. Um, against Jasper, actually, which is uh, an interesting point. Uh, at the very beginning of the game, we fought Jasper in this port town. And, uh, of course, Eric falls down. And, uh, you know, he's like, no, go! Uh, you'll all get captured and killed! Uh, just leave me behind. And so we leave him behind. And then, you know, later we we go rescue him from Jasper and we fight him. And it was actually kind of a tough battle. Oh, it was a tough battle. Oh my goodness. It was a tough battle because I was actually using Eric as one of my main party members. And then the game was just like, hey, you like Eric? You can't use him right now. And that kind of crippled my team because I had to use Silvando, who, you know, didn't really have the best of equipment. Uh, I didn't know how to use them very well. And so that was a very difficult fight to deal with. Never just one. Alrighty, so vacuum smash. Hey. hey. That was not bad. Let's check out what frost fangs do. That was weak. We are getting punished. Go with the quadra. Ha! 
tired of that nonsense. with the XAML. Should have learned from that experience leave Eric behind. Jesus. Sometimes we gotta... Really? He just went. Um, sometimes we gotta, you know, uh, keep the people that we don't want close. And you get Rab. You can actually get that magical might. Wouldn't be too terrible. That costs twenty. Oh, that costs twelve. Come on. They're all just stupid expensive. Critical and some inflicting critical spell strikes. Uh, I mean, this is going to be the final battle, so I should I should get something. So I guess I'm getting ending. Lightly increases the effectiveness of the user's spells. That is not that great. Eric, I went the boomerang route with you. But agility. Hey! Twelve. We'll grab the deafness because it's a little bit cheaper. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my gosh. This ability is insane. Oh my goodness. Could you imagine divide with critical claim? Holy crap. Holy crap. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right, Serena. Still can't get the pep. The Earth Light Thunder. All righty, that's basically everybody. No, now there's multiple trash. Oh, man. Eric just can't win. Three times as trash. Poor guy. Okay. Uh, you keep them close because they make for good bear bait. Time to use that bait. Hey, man, when, when I get to the point where my entire party dies and the secondary party, you know, has to, has to pull their weight, that's when Eric is going to be useful. He's, he's got some hit points on him. Zero times three is still zero. <laughs> I, I could have built Eric a little bit better. Um, if I made him daggers or swords, he'd be in a better spot right now. Where are we at, in fact? Okay.
Um, that doppelganger ability is so cool. That makes Eric good. I'm telling you. Three times the damage. Man, if only boomerangs weren't trash. Alright, here we go. The final fight. And everybody else is good to go here. Looks like this will transport you to the Palace of Malice. Use it. Yeah, buddy. The Fortress of Fear. I don't see any save points. An aura of ultimate evil emanates from within. It must be the Lord of Shadows. Are you ready to enter? I am. I saved. <laughs> 